Hello, in this tutorial we're going to talk about how you can hide responses as well as hide questions in live surveys. We'll also touch upon uh, how you can also alphabetize uh, the ordering of response lists. Um, I'm here in the Survey Manager in our OM test account in the Surveys tab, as you can see. I've already created a hide response, I, I, an online survey labeled hide responses and let me just go in here and edit that and I'll show you um, go to the wizard uh, in the define questions uh, step step one of the five step wizard um, you'll see here in the first question I have created a list of names and this of course could be a list of anything but let's say it's a healthcare facility and you're asking what doctor the patient is here to see or a financial institution uh, what teller or uh, representative did you uh, meet with or serviced your needs today um, and so I'm going to go in here and edit this question and show you how let's say this survey has been running for three months and one of the doctors left the organization or one of the bank tellers has left the organization you don't want to have to recreate your survey uh, to just remove one name uh, this way you can go in and hide uh, a response so we'll go ahead oops and edit this question here and I am going to <clears throat> uh, hide Russell John so I'm gonna go in and hide response and you'll see uh, it, the screen updates and it gives us an HD which is the acronym for hide response and I just select that adjacent the um, the name I want to hide uh, I can also alphabetize responses which I uh, had already checked um, so that after Russell's removed the list will re-alphabetize which is a nice feature to have uh, you can also hide the question let's say you have a 10 question survey or a 100 question survey and you want to remove or hide uh, a few of those questions without having to re uh, uh, redo the entire survey you can go in here and check hide question and that will automatically hide the entire question from appearing in your survey and of course as with any of our surveys you can uh, distribute this as an offline or an online survey uh, to a mobile web browser or our native survey apps running on iOS Android Windows etc so since we're uh, our system does support multi-mode uh, when you do it here you can also apply it to any of your distribution methods of the survey so I'm gonna keep the question I'm not gonna hide the question I'm just gonna hide that one response and before we do um, well let's go ahead I thought I'd already saved this but let's go ahead um, and I'll save this and I can actually preview at any point in the wizard so let's go ahead and preview and it shows me I can either preview this on a uh, PC browser or a mobile browser or a tablet browser and our our uh, mobile and tablet browsers are full HTML5 capable very rich feature functionality there um, okay I'm gonna preview this right here on my PC browser and you'll see Russell is no longer in the list of question one uh, and it did alphabetize uh, the remaining responses correctly so why don't we close this I'm gonna go back to question one I'm gonna edit this again and I'm gonna bring back that hidden uh, let's say Russell John uh, came back from vacation and now he's back in the organization I don't want to hide him anymore I'll keep alphabetized uh, um, responses on save and I can preview again and if your survey is live this will just update in real time to any live survey you have already uh, published so let's preview again here in our PC browser option and now we see Russell John who given R is the last uh, uh, to be in the alphabetized uh, uh, listing uh, sequence of question one so quickly we have just to review we have gone over how you can hide a response or more than one response in a live survey that's already been published uh, you can choose to if you wish to re-alphabetize that response list uh, afterwards um, you can also these are uh, mutually exclusive so you can 
alphabetize your list and not hide anything, of course. And you can also, we didn't do this, but you can also hide the entire question if you wish. Uh, and again, let's just show you the, um, the UI here, the user interface of this. So hide response, checkbox at the bottom, hide question, and alphabetize. So this concludes uh, this short tutorial. Thank you very much for your time.